Hello and welcome to New This Week on Artsla.com, the sound of independence. Today on the show, I have a diva who is a singer extraordinaire. She shot to fame with a reality show on Channel V and formed nation's first ever boy-girl band, Asma. Within a short span of time, she's become the darling of the industry, having performed with the best of the best. Having opened the world tours for Shankar Mahadevan and A.R. Rahman, she's proved her worth. Today on the show, she's all set to launch her three new singles on artslove.com. Please welcome the versatile Neeti Mohan. Neeti, welcome to the show and I must say you're looking gorgeous. Thank you. Ah. <laughs> you know, how many years that you won the pop star contest and you became part of this wonderful band called Asma? Uh, that happened in 2003. 2003. So, that's been long. That's been really long. It's been nine years and you look exactly the same. Yes. And in fact, I must say that you look beautiful by the day. Thank you. Thanks for pulling my leg, but I don't care. <laughs> I'm, be, I'm serious, you know, what, okay, you know, on the show, I, whatever I say is absolutely the truth because I'm under oath. Okay. Yeah. I believe you. Yeah. Seriously, I say Geeta, Sapna, Anjali, Suman, I say all of them. That what is, this is true. So, there is no one here, everyone is running. What? Now, there is no one here. What do you know? Who, 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 from winning a reality show. And you know, in fact, we could also say that your family could be the first family, you know, who could actually owe your success to these reality shows. Actually, we really uh, respect these platforms. Yeah. Because me, my sister Shakti and Mukti, yeah. we all had no connection yeah. from this, uh, this field right. you know, of performing arts. So what we had to do was just go and try our luck and perform so well so that you could win, get spotted, get the platform and, uh, and make use of that and, and then make a career uh, from the reality shows. And if I'm not wrong, you never wanted to be a part of it. It was your sister, it was your younger sister. Was it Shakti or Mukti who pushed you? All to of them. Yeah. Because I, I used to sing, dance, act and do choreograph yeah. and direct something. Yeah. So it, it used to come very naturally to me. Yeah. Anything related to performing arts right from my childhood. So that's how, that's how when they heard of Viva yeah. and it became such a big success. Yes. Uh, then when, when Asma auditions were happening, pop yeah. stars too. So my sisters, my parents, they all were like, you fit the bill and how. So do you think that this is a dream come true? It is, it <coughs> is. It's secretly, I always wanted to be uh, on stage, holding the mic, performing and, and always be under the spotlight. But somewhere I had this, uh, this inhibition mm. that maybe my family would not uh, be really proud of me if I took performing arts as career. Because yeah. I think 2003 and before that, yeah. there was no career like that. Yeah. That was the first time the, the reality show started. This yes. was one of the first reality shows right. in India. And so then the trend followed and then actually parents and people who came from middle class families, they kind yeah. of started believing that there could be a career in performing arts, in singing, in dancing. In it's quite interesting you mentioned that you came from a middle class background, uh, four sisters in total. Uh, what's the name of the fourth one? Actually, Neeti, I'm the eldest, then it's Kriti. Kriti. Then it's Shakti. Shakti. Then it's Mukti. Mukti, kya baat hai. 